Welcome everyone, this afternoon we are taking a look at the Winko 64 ounce decanter. I've had this item for about a month now and it's a really good budget decanter for serving coffee, for making tea, pretty much any hot beverage. But my favorite thing about it is the precision with which it can pour. I like to make uh, drip coffee with a Chemex style coffee maker, this one over here. And for that you need a lot of control over how you're pouring the hot water over. And this decanter works great for that. I'm going to show you that in a little bit. In this video, I'm going to be covering three parts. So first, I'm going to go over the specifications of this item. Then I'm going to show you a demo of how I make some drip coffee with it. And finally, I'm going to go over functionality. So let's begin with a few measurements. The decanter is six inches tall. The tallest part is right here at the spout. And the diameter of the bottom section is five and one half inches. It's made of stainless steel with a plastic handle. It's got a lid which is open with this thumb tab over here. Opens and closes. The handle is attached with two screws to a metal bracket and the bracket is spot welded to the unit with five spot welds. And now for our demo, we're gonna make some fresh coffee and I love handmade drip coffee. I got my Winko decanter filled up with some hot water and the trick to this, it's two steps. First, I want to make sure that all of this coffee grinds, I got to make sure they're all soaked. So I'm going to pour a little bit over. I'm just going to stir. Make sure all of these are nice and soaked. Now the trick to a good handmade drip coffee. Pour slowly and pour in a circular motion. Watch how I'm going around this cone. And as the coffee drains, we can see all of these grinds that are piling up right on the edge of the cone. And that is why we do a small trickle now. We're going to pour this water as slowly as we can. I've got this electric water pitcher. And it's always so difficult whenever I make drip coffee with it. Because whenever I pour, it just ends up all over the place. The water goes under the spout and ends up all over my countertop. But this Winko decanter, look at that. It's not dripping at all. It goes right where it's supposed to. It's all done and it looks incredible. There's never a bad time for coffee. Moving on to the last part of our video, functionality. My favorite part about this decanter, like I already mentioned, the precision with which it pours. The water, you can pour it as fast or as slow as you want. And the whole time I've been using it, I never had it once drip off to the side or go under the spout. Everything just works as intended. The next part I really like about it, you can open up the slit and you can get in there with a sponge and you can clean it. A lot of issues I see with some of the smaller decanters is that they have the long neck spouts and it's very difficult to get in there to clean. You have to use one of those long brushes. And finally, fit and finish. No scratches, no dents, no sharp edges. Everything is ready to use right out of the box. I like it when I don't have to do any touch-up or any sanding or any polishing. And this unit is just ready to use. To sum things up, this decanter is great for any hot beverage. Whether you're just making tea for yourself, or whether you have four or five people you're serving some coffee to, this is great. And it's cheap. I like it when things are affordable on a budget. This decanter only $10 and that's a fraction of what I see comparable ones going for. Anyways, I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section and I will get them answered for you.